Hey everyone, I'm David, beauty director at Sephora, and this is a really cool video. It's more in response to a lot of the comments we get, which is what to do when you're building a skincare routine for mature skin. So listen, this is something we're all gonna have to deal with at some point in our life, whether you're dealing with it now, or you're approaching it, or you soon to be approaching it. I am in it. <laughs> I am proudly in my 40s, and I am seeing changes in my skin. And that's what happens. As we mature, our skin changes. So you may need to change your skincare routine a little. You may need to look for specific ingredients to be in products in your skincare routine to address certain concerns that are unique to mature skin. So in this video, I'm gonna walk you through what I think is a really great, pretty universal skincare routine for mature skin. So we're gonna start with the basics, the first thing we all have to do, which is cleanse our skin. So up first, we have Tatcha, and this is the Deep Cleanse Exfoliating Cleanser. So this is a fantastic gel cleanser it creates this beautiful lather, rich, creamy, moisturizing while cleansing. It removes impurities, dirt, debris, without stripping your skin. That is essential when it comes to mature skin. The last thing you wanna be doing is cleaning your skin and removing everything off of it. You know, getting rid of all that good hydration that's there. So this does not do that. Plus, one of the things that's really cool about this there's an ingredient in here called loofah. It's from the loofah fruit. It's actually the original inspiration for our modern day loofah sponge. So some of that fruit fiber is in here and it helps to gently exfoliate the skin. And the extract of that fruit actually nourishes and conditions your skin. So this is a great cleanser, morning, nighttime. Use it, keep your skin cleansed, keep your skin purified, but also, free of stripping or removing with any harsh ingredients. That's a key when it comes to mature skin. That's a key to what you're looking for in your cleanser. So up next, this is a bit of a, what would I call this? A, um, a, a mysterious product, an essence, right? We all hear this essence and we're like, okay, should I have an essence? What actually is it? So essence and toners, tend to be confused quite often. They are not the same thing. Toners, just for your own knowledge, tend to work on refining your pores, whereas an essence is more about imbuing your skin with hydration prior to the rest of your hydrating steps. And that's a key aspect when it comes to skin, which is very similar to a sponge. So sponges absorb more moisture as they're wet. When they're dry, they don't absorb a lot of moisture. So using an essence, you actually start the hydrating process and you allow the rest of your routine to work better. Now this one in particular, I love, it's from SK2 and it's the Facial Treatment Essence. This is an iconic, and I really do mean an iconic product. And here's one of the things that I love about this. So an essence, as you can see, is very watery. So here's the thing. Anything really lightweight like that and watery tends to penetrate the skin deeper. So it really has a really fantastic boost to your routine. It really starts that process in a great way. Plus, it also tends to bring a lot of those nutrients that we really need to go pretty deep into our skin, fast and easy delivery. Now, one of the things that's so fantastic about this product is it contains over 90% Patera. So that word probably means nothing to you, but there's a cool backstory to it that I love. Basically, a lot of skincare ingredients are discovered in weird, random observations, and this was no exception to that. Basically, researchers looking at sake brewers realized that some of these sake brewers who were mature, older, had hands that looked 20 years younger than the rest of their skin. And they're like, wait a minute, what's going on? So they realized that something in that fermentation, that sake process, was keeping their skin on their hands to almost rejuvenate itself. That was how they discovered this ingredient, Patera, which is a fantastic bio-ingredient, and it really works to help your skin rejuvenate and refresh itself and keep it sort of um, revitalized. That's why this is great for anyone, really at any age, but a 
fantastic addition to someone who is looking for a routine that targets mature skin, I highly recommend this essence, and I highly recommend you start trying essences. Okay, so the next thing I wanna talk about is serums. And these are very important to any skincare routine. And for me, I think of them as like your jet booster pack. Like this is how you get those intense ingredients delivered fast and effectively into your skin. They tend to be lightweight, not as lightweight as like a watery essence, but also not as heavy as a moisturizer. So they're a perfect addition into your skincare routine. They're not gonna add any weight to your skincare routine, but they are gonna deliver a big punch of superpower ingredients. So first up, what I wanna talk about is a serum from The Ordinary. It's buffet, that's what it's called, and it is literally a buffet of peptides. It is a super powerful peptide serum. It contains something called Matrixel 3000, which probably doesn't mean a lot to you guys. It shouldn't, unless you're a skincare fanatic, that shouldn't mean a lot to you. But I do wanna talk about what it is, especially in terms of peptides. Peptides are a really key ingredient. You're gonna see this in a lot of skincare products that are targeted towards anti-aging. Why is a peptide good for you? We're gonna get a little sciencey for a second. I'm a bit of a science nerd, but I'm gonna keep it really simple because I wanna make sure you guys understand this. Peptides are the small parts of a protein chain, okay? Protein is what makes up our body. Basically, our skin is proteins. Collagen is a protein. Elastin is a protein. So you get where I'm going here. As we age, collagen, it's harder for our body to produce it. The signs, the, 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 the mechanism from our brain to tell our body to produce more collagen kind of slows down. This is what happens, right? This is how we lose volume in our face. We lose that collagen. So what a peptide does when you apply it topically is it can help your body's response mechanism sort of revive that communication. Let's produce more collagen. Here's some of these building blocks, these peptides. We can actually use these to make collagen. So this is why peptides are so important and really addressing mature skin is because that peptide provides a building block to your skin to help it do what it did when it was younger. A great, great option here. I really like The Ordinary a lot. So the next serum I wanna talk about, I'm doing two, and for a specific reason. This is the Alginus Genius Ultimate Anti-Aging Vitamin C Plus Serum. Vitamin C, we've talked about it. I did a whole video on it. You guys can look at that whole video. I'm sure we could put a link somewhere. Vitamin C is a powerhouse ingredient, especially for anti-aging. So there's a great acronym. You've probably heard me use it before. Vitamin C is your BLT, like a BLT sandwich. It brightens it lightens and it tightens. That's what we need, <laughs> that's anti-aging right there. There it is, you got your anti-aging. So vitamin C is so fantastic on the skin. It really does help your skin brighten. It helps to clarify it. It helps with uneven skin tone. It helps reduce the appearance of dark spots. It helps to firm, helps with wrinkles. I mean, it just is an all around fantastic ingredient for mature skin. I personally think everyone who is looking to address the, the concerns of mature skin, you should have vitamin C at some area of your routine, there should be a vitamin C additive in there. There should be some good vitamin C or vitamin C derivative in your routine. Look for it, it's wonderful. This one in particular also, what I love about Alginist, they have a really cool ingredient called algoronic acid, which is derived from marine algae. So basically, again, with like cool how things are discovered, researchers realize that algae, it's been on the planet forever, can live in any harsh environment. Why? Why does this stuff rejuvenate, regenerate? It can be in the worst situations and it keeps living partially due to this algoronic acid. When it's used in skincare topically, it is a wonderful anti-aging ingredient. It helps entirely omni with all of your concerns that are anti-aging, meaning anything from 
dark spots to plumpness, to hydration, to wrinkles. It is one of those anti-aging powerhouse ingredients. When you combine that with vitamin C, you have a very powerhouse packed serum that in addition to the rest of your routine is definitely gonna help address those mature skin concerns. I love this. So up next, very important, y'all need to be starting this even in your 20s, eye cream. Eye cream. Your eyes are probably gonna be the first area that you see the signs of aging. That skin is very thin, it's very delicate, and it's mobile. We move it, we touch it, we rub that area constantly. It, it gets a lot of damage and it starts showing the signs really early. You need a good eye cream. You need to be using it morning and night. This one in particular, I really love. It's from Shiseido. It's Benefiance Wrinkle Resist 24 Intensive Eye Contour Cream. Now there's a couple of reasons why I love this one, especially for what we're talking about. And a key to that is it's a extremely hydrating eye cream that will definitely help to visibly plump that eye area. 360, meaning you can use it entirely around your eye, under and above, but no greasy residue, quick absorption. So when it comes to mature skin, especially in the eye area, what are we dealing with, right? We're dealing with fine lines, wrinkles, sagging skin, crow's feet. These things are also a concern when it comes to our makeup, right? When you're applying a concealer, the last thing you want is this heavy eye cream that you feel like you need because we know we need that intensive moisture there, but that's also making our concealer sink into any wrinkles or crow's feet. So it's this double-edged sword. It's like, what do you do? And then you powder too much and then you find you're not happy with it and it's like, ah! what do I do? This is a great answer to that because it provides what you need in that area, especially in the mature area of life when you need that intense hydration without any of that residue or greasiness that's gonna make the next step, let's say your concealers or your, or your um, eye makeup in general, slip and slide around. And honestly, I know we're talking about mature skin, but personally, I think everyone starting in their 20s should be using an eye cream. And I think this is a great eye cream for anyone because of the fast absorption and because of what it delivers. It's great for prevention, and it's also great for if you're dealing with those concerns, like me. So up next, we have the final step. So you gotta moisturize your skin, right? We know that one of the key changes you will most likely see in your skin as you age is dryness. Skin tends to lose its ability to hold, produce, and retain moisture. Even if you're oily. Now, I, I read a lot of the comments that we get, and we've done videos on skincare and, and mature skin, and I've heard a lot of you guys talk about like, well, hey, I'm mature, I'm in my 60s or 70s, but I'm still really oily, so I don't want, you know, a lot of these traditional heavy, you know, this is the anti-aging product and it's really heavy. Look, technology now has definitely given us a wide range of products that can suit anyone, even if you are super oily. Oil is not hydration. So you still need to hydrate. You will definitely see an improvement in the skin texture with hydration, especially when it comes to mature skin. So the product I chose is from Peter Thomas Roth, and this is the Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream. Personally, I use this one myself. I love it because even though I'm not oily anymore, definitely one of the symptoms that I've seen in my skin show that I'm, I'm getting older, I'm maturing, is that my skin has become more dry, like there's no denying it. But I still don't like heavy feeling moisturizers. I, my skin will react to that. So I have that double-edged sword. I need the hydration, but I can't have the weight. I find with this, there is a 30% hyaluronic acid in here. That is a very high amount of hyaluronic acid. And what that does is hyaluronic acid takes literally the vapor the atmospheric vapor, and it can turn it into fresh, pure water for your skin to lock in, hydrate, and retain. And that's the key. It can retain that moisture for days. So when you apply a cream like this, it feels lightweight. 
hence the name Cloud Cream, because it really feels like nothing. It absorbs instantly into the skin, but you see the appearance of rejuvenated, plump, refreshed skin, hydrated skin, glowing skin that stays that way for days. So I don't feel like I need to constantly add moisturizer. So something like this is a great moisturizer for anyone at any level of skin type, whether you're extremely dry or extremely oily, but definitely if you're in the mature skin zone, you will benefit from a intense hyaluronic moisturizer like this. And when you add in the rest of that routine, you've created this beautiful uh, uh, system that's supplying your skin with everything it needs to treat and address those concerns, make sure that all aspects of aging are being dealt with and nourished and revitalized. And you're not gonna feel like you have a thousand pounds of product on your face. Nobody wants to feel like that. I don't like to feel like that. I like to feel like my skin's my skin. So nowadays, technology has really allowed all these products to provide you with all this fantastic stuff and no weight. So there you have it. A great, what I think is a really fantastic routine for mature skin, really talking about what you're looking for, some key ingredients that you should have in top of mind when you are searching for your skincare. I definitely advise you all, everyone's skin is unique. Please, if you don't know your skin, if you're not like a skincare fanatic like some of us are, pop into your local Sephora. Get a service with one of our skincare advisors. We have complimentary services. We have full like one-on-one -on -one sit down services where you can, there's so much that we have in store right now that can really help you to identify your skin, find out which one of these ingredients is best for you, what stage of your routine they will be best for. Because once you create that great skincare routine, I guarantee you, you are going to see an improvement in your skin's look and performance. So hopefully this was really helpful for you guys. I love talking about this stuff. Please let me know in the comments section below if this was helpful, if any of these products are something you're like, hmm, I wanna use that now, maybe I'm gonna try the whole routine. Uh, maybe you're using some of them and you wanna give a great review, please do that too. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel where you guys can get new videos from us every single week. And until next time, get those great skincares going and we'll see you soon. Take care, bye.